uh, previously, historically, if we look at history, I like to use history as a roadmap because, you know, as Mark Twain says, it doesn't always repeat, but it often rhymes. And that's absolutely true. And historically, all economies, empires, currencies, systems come to an end. And um, the currency, uh, excuse me, the monetary system that we currently have is a fraud uh, Ponzi scheme. It's literally the definition of a Ponzi scheme. It's uh, and it has nothing backing it except confidence. That's it. Confidence from the people. But if people really understood what was going on, the system would collapse overnight, literally. Now, technology such as cryptocurrency and blockchain technology, uh, it's a double edged sword because it can give the power to the people, the Web 3.0, this whole concept. But at the same time, the central banks, the financial institutions and the big players, they understand that if they don't control this, then it will be the end of their, their time. So with blockchain technology, yes, it has the power to literally eliminate the banking system. Um, and that's why they're working with companies that bring the blockchain solutions. It's so that they do not get eliminated from the equation. It's not because they want the best for humanity. Obviously, they don't. Okay, this is elite bloodline families, aristocrats that have their hands in everything, you know, and um, taking care of the people is not in their best interests. What is in their best interest is maintaining their power and control through the monetary system and innovation taking place. Wow.